Hello, good evening. I'm sorry about um, the close-up. Um, I'm about to go to sleep, and um, you know, I don't have a computer, so I'm using my phone. And um, I kind of wanted to talk about the debate. I didn't watch it. I had no interest whatsoever in watching it. I know why all this is happening. I don't trust any of them. Was the economy better under Trump? Yes, do I trust him? No. Definitely don't trust her. I'm going to try and talk without my hands. I'm Italian. I'm from New York. We all talk with our hands, so um, I guess it's a family thing. But, um, yeah, I just kind of wanted to um, talk about the debate. I periodically go in and ask my mother how it's going because I had no interest in watching it. And she, my mother supports Trump. She voted for him last time around. I didn't vote. You know, I got family and friends literally getting, like, almost angry with me saying, you have to vote. You got to vote. Don't don't tell me you're not going to vote. I'm like, no, I'm not going to vote. But, um, yeah, she voted for Trump. She supports Trump. Um, like I said, was the economy better under him? Yes. Do I trust him? No. But with the four, and I was just talking to God, and um, after I was on my Facebook, and I'll get to why I was on my Facebook in a second, but I was like, God, I, I pray that we're going home soon. I know your timing's perfect, but it's so bad. It's so bad. How could anybody in their right mind, how could anybody in their right mind, how can anybody in their sane right mind want four more years of this? You know? Um, so, um, it's like, we know Biden was not in the best health. For censorship reasons, I can't say what, it begins with an A, I think it begins with that, what they think he has. If he's even still here, around, you know. He's very old, he can't put two and two together. So, with the initials O and her, they've been calling the shots. Why would anybody in the right mind want four more years of this? Gas through the roof, rents through the roof, grocery, forget about it. Why would anybody want four more years of this? She's standing on a platform. I'm going to fix things. But she's in office now and hasn't fixed it and it's got worse. She's going to fix something that she was a part of messing up. When they uh, a reporter asked her if she's been to the border, she laughed and said, I haven't been to Europe either. I've said it before, guys. I'll say it again. She's going to get in in the same way he got in, if you know what I mean. I've been saying that for freaking years. Well, not years. No, months. Months. Maybe a year. I don't You know what I'm saying. I was on Facebook. A friend of mine that I've known since high school. She put makes a post to call me crazy, but I like her. She goes, delete me if you want, but I like her. I said, I'm not going to delete you. I don't trust any of them, you know. But people that have supported him are starting to support her. And I'm thinking to myself, why? You want four more years of this? She's going to make Biden look like the good guy. And he's bad. No, he, Biden's not a good guy, trust me. He's not. I'm not saying he's a good guy. I say, oh, watch. Uh, um, Sister Christ said Biden's a good No, he's not. He was... She's going to make him look like a good guy. She's going to be that bad. Why? 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 Would anybody want four more years of this? So basically, she's going to fix what she helped cause. She's never been in support of building a wall. Now she's going to build it. So when people make a post, they, I don't know. Delete me. I like her. I'm like, you do realize she's acting, right? And she's not being on the up and up, right? I'm like, God, why? Why? When the Antichrist comes to power, I'm not saying she's the Antichrist, but heck, <laughs> she's she's not the Antichrist. She's definitely his good buddy. I'm, I mean, when the Antichrist comes to power, the world is going to be deceived. The world is going to be fooled into thinking that everything that he's saying, everything that's coming out of his mouth is truth, and he's a wonderful person. 
and the deceiver is starting now. This woman is wicked. And I hope you can say that on here. I don't know if you can say For censorship reasons, this is my opinion. 100% my opinion. My opinion is she's W-I-C-K-E. You know what? My opinion. Um, I think uh, I had it last time I got a strike. I had a hard time getting a message through to you guys. Uh, what, what is it? Redeemed 51, I think, is my backup channel. But the deceivery is, has been going around for a while. Yes, it has. But it's what I meant is it's amping up now. Because I'm trying to figure out a way to put this. Um, hopefully, you know what I'm trying to say. People and people that are people are switching to her, and for them to switch to her after hearing her, kind of just goes to show you there's going to be a lot of people deceived when the tribulation happens they're going to believe the charismatic dapper educated world leader that's going to come on the scene and they're just going to buy what he's selling just like they're switching and buying what she's selling it's being divided right now Us, who are going to be raptured, and the world that's going to be left behind, and buy what the Antichrist says. All we can do is keep planting seeds, you know. But if people are starting to switch to her after the four years that we've had, they're being deceived. And when the Antichrist comes to power, the world is going to be deceived. All we can do is keep warning, you know, but it's sad um, to see family, friends. I've, I've known, I've known these people, let's see, I'm 55 years old. We all went to high school together, so I've known them since I was 15. They're being deceived. 100%. She's, she's acting. They're all acting. All of them. Trump too. But especially her. Because for anybody to... She can fix it now. Because we know that he doesn't have the you-know-whats to do it because he's so old. That's when the VP steps in. And the president can't fulfill his job. And I know that's what they say in the, in the pageants, but you know what I'm saying. The VP steps in. She hasn't done it. She's caused all this. She's helped cause all this, but she's going to fix what she helped cause. And people going, oh, I like what she says. I like what she, really? I, I can't handle it anymore, guys. I, I, just, I pray every night for the rapture. I really do. I just, I can't handle this stuff anymore. It's tough, but you know, I... I say that. I can't handle it more, but it's just me venting, you know? I mean, God will get us through. Jesus is with us. He will get us through. And we're, praise the Lord, we're about to go home, and I pray it's this year. Because the world is, is being deceived. People in this country that are switching to her are being deceived. That's it, the world being deceived. Let me rephrase that. This The people that, let me rephrase that, not the world. The people in this country that are going to start switching to her. What, just because she practiced what to say in front of a camera? I found out. I don't know if I can say this. The podiums that they're on. She's a lot. She's she's a lot shorter than Trump. She didn't want to look like he was this big Trump. And then she's this little, you know. So I heard that she wanted the podium. Lower. That's what I heard, you know, so don't quote me on it, but that's what I heard. Um, I just want to share that with you guys. The world is being deceived, and we got to put on the floor of our God and keep planting seeds and pray for our family, pray for our friends, and pray for each other. 
because um, guys, between now and the rapture, we may start seeing some friends and family being deceived. All you can do is keep praying for them. Because if they, I'm trying to figure out the best way to put this. If people are going to, after the four years of, you, of hell that we've had, with gas, food, rent, everything, if people are going to start switching to her, knowing that she is partially to blame for all this, the deceivery, you know what I'm saying? There's always been deceivery around, you know? But it's getting worse and worse. I'm trying. I hope you know what I'm saying because I can't figure out the best way to put it. And we're going to start seeing family and friends being deceived. All we can do is pray. The rapture... Is going to happen. The rapture is going to happen very, very soon. I think we can all feel it. You do not want to be here. You do not want to be here for what's about to happen. Bam. I'm going to have my young body, my new healthy body. <laughs> I can't wait. But, um, you don't want to be here, man. It's going to be so bad. And we got to pray for each other and our family and our friends because. It, it's just, she's going to destroy this country, guys. But you know what? I made a post on my Facebook. I'm like, there's no world leader that's going to fix this problem. This is a spiritual problem. And you can call, call me crazy if you want, but they said the same thing to Noah. But the rapture is about to happen. And, sorry, I thought I just got a text. And anybody, I, I pray for anybody that buys what these politicians say. Because they're acting. Hello. They're acting. They're telling you what you want to hear. And that's exactly what the Antichrist is going to do. And the world's going to buy it. Hook, line, and sinker. You know? It's uh, these. Are, it's really sad. It's sad to see family and friends being deceived. I had no interest in watching it. I'm looking for the return of Jesus. I... Could give two flippity flues at either one of them, say. Because you know what? Reality is when the bombs drop and they're about to drop, they're going to save themselves, man. It's like, well, like, well, I'm here for you. I'm here for you. I'm going to help you. I'm going to help you. You can help yourself, you know? It's it's sad. I, I've, I've, known, I've known them since high school, like 15 years old. I'm 55. We're going to start seeing family and friends possibly deceived guys. And we just got to pray for them, you know. The world. The world's on the verge of annihilation. It's at the point where God has to send Jesus to rapture us because it's just so bad. We can feel it with everything in us. I mean, we may not even be here by the elections. I've always said, those of you that have been listening to my channel for a while, I heard November and... I mean, I know, maybe it's my ditz blonde moment, but I actually, when I heard November, I actually forgot when the election was, and I heard November, and uh, I was like, why did I just hear November? And um, those of you that didn't listen to my channel for a while have always said, I don't know why, but 2024 keeps sticking in my head. I just, it's something about this year, you know, I can't put my finger on it. I pray it's the rapture. Is <laughs> this is... Because that, that just kind of dropped in, kind of dropped in my spirits. You know, the world, people in this country that are, that are switching, are, they're, they're being deceived. And kind of in a, in a similar way, they're going to be deceived when the Antichrist comes to power, which we won't be here for. It's like a fog of deceivery fell on the country, if you know what I mean. And it's always been there. But it's like a thicker fog, if you know what I mean. I'm trying to figure out the best way to put it. Hopefully you guys know what I'm saying. I'm not good at putting words together, but... And I'm really tired right now. Um, it is... Man. It's... I said it before, I'll say it again. She's. She, they're going to do exactly what they did four years ago, man. She's going to get in. Civil war is about to break out in this country. And... We may not make it to the lectures. I, I hope we don't. But as you can tell, I'm really tired. I'm going to go to bed. Um, I have a um, 
a beautiful sister in Christ. I love you, Jennifer. Thank you so much. Who is sending me a um, a new boot for my foot? Because the boot that she has, and um, she doesn't use it anymore. I said, are you sure you don't need it? And she, she said she hasn't used it in a while. She don't need it. She got it for her daughter, and her daughter doesn't need it anymore. But um, this boot is better than the one I have. The one I have has no padding. Um, this boot has this inflatable something that you put up on the side. And um, it has um, a lot of cushion on the sides and the bottom. So, Because my foot hasn't healed even the slightest bit in, in three weeks. So um, I was going to see if I could see a doctor earlier. But I'm going to wait until my appointment on the 17th. And then I'm going to have to ask him to do an x-ray. So I can see in that two-week period if it healed anymore. And now with this boot, um, I'm going to have more padding. So maybe it'll help. So um, thank you so much, Jennifer. Thank you so much for sending that to me. And um, we're all about to get our new glorified bodies. I'm, I'm excited. I'm so excited. No more menopause. Gen X, all the Gen X guys. Um, excuse me. No more menopause. <laughs> no more menopause. Yay. Okay, I'm going to show you. I got right here. I got a lot of stuff on my end table, so I don't want to. But that's my heater, right? And over there is my fan. <laughs> I'm not lying, guys. For real. I have a heater and a fan that I keep on every night. All night, it's like, okay, I'm hot. Oh, I'm cold. See, I got a sweater on because I was cold. Now I got to take it off because I'm hot. <laughs> so I won't have to go through that anymore. It's, but mostly, we're about to see Jesus. It's... I prayed tonight. That'd be that'd be awesome. And um, yeah, I'm I'm excited. I'm ready to go. But we're 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 gonna be hitting some dark some dark times, guys. Even darker than what we're going through now. And we might even see family and friends being deceived. You know, so we gotta pray for them. I love you guys. Good night. God bless you. And I'll talk to you soon.